quarantine shopping at uh, Coop Mart in uh, Suncha. So uh, look at it, it's barely anybody at the supermarket because as you can tell, barely anybody in the supermarket. But guess what, prices are cheap, <laughs> dude. It's so freaking cheap right now because they start, they're trying to get rid of everything because there's barely any customers. So you're getting everything at a discounted or a sale price here. <laughs> awesome. I think I'm gonna give me a, a box of this right here. This uh, Nescafe cappuccino looks pretty good. Turn this one. No. No. No, you cannot. Uh, which one? So this is what you can look at. This is like discounted prices right here. So this is uh, this is high uh, high chew by by cham high chew by cham. Hai nín. Hai nín. I'm sorry. Hai nín. Thao yen Việt Nam đồng. Yeah. Hai nín. Hai nín by uh, by cham. Gạo uh, gạo thơm. Uh, Jasmine. Gạo thơm. Gạo thơm. Oh, gạo thơm. Gạo thơm. Gào tôm. It's kind of fun. You guys get to learn some Vietnamese with me at the same time, right? Two. Mì lẩu tai. Mì lẩu tai. <laughs> ah, Kem, ice cream. Kem, Kem. Kem, For all the paper in America who need toilet paper, we got plenty of toilet paper here in Vietnam. <laughs> Look at that. It's like 46,000, man. Look at all that toilet paper. Look at all that toilet paper. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. You need, if you need some, just let me know. I'll, sh I'll send you guys a couple boxes. All right. Five bucks for like a big roll of toilet paper. This is actually discounted. Like I said, discounted prices. Sixty dollars worth of groceries here. I swear to God, in the United States, uh, West, most Western countries. This right here will be about couple, close to 200 bucks. So this is like 60 bucks. $60 worth of groceries right here. $60, bro. Like, you can't, you can't beat it. You can't beat it, you know what I'm saying? It's the 15th. Now it's uh, April 15th. Um, I just heard that we actually have two more weeks of, uh, of quarantine. Um, I'm not sure how true that is. I didn't get any, I didn't get any updates on my phone. Or anything like that about the quarantine, but apparently, uh, I spoke to my friend about it. And they said there's uh, two more weeks of quarantine here in Da Nang. Uh, I just came from walking about, I mean, not what came from uh, um, making a couple of errands, and it's busy. I mean, there's people everywhere. I mean, I just went to the grocery market, I went to two grocery markets, as a matter of fact, went to Cook Mart and um, Vin, Vin Mart, and I just also, I also went to the bakery. So, all those areas I went to. And I'm sorry, I, I was try, I was thinking about actually filming it, but I can't because right now I'm practicing how to actually ride a motorbike. And I don't want to actually film and ride a motorbike at the same time. So I see this is this is my neighborhood. It's, I'm actually walking through my neighborhood right now. I'm actually gonna go out to the main areas. So I'm gonna let you see what the main areas look like 
in terms of being busy. I'm approaching the main area, so I put my mask back on. So, you know, sometimes people kind of like give you that funny look if you're not wearing your mask. Because as I was walking down the street, I did get some looks from, from people who were like, hey, you know, wear your mask kind of thing. So, um, um, yeah. This is, um, Wen Chun Tuk Street. As you can see behind me. As you can see, there's a lot of people out getting some exercise, uh, 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 relax. I mean, relaxing, just taking a walk. You know, there's a lot of kids out as well, um, having fun. Um, I mean, like I said, we are in a what do you call a mandatory quarantine, but it's not a quarantine to the point where you have to stay in your house consistently. You know, um, and you can't and you can't get out. You know, we can get out. You know, we just that. You know, we have to be mindful. A little bit of social distancing, you know, be mindful of others, and that's it. It's common sense, right? Common sense. That's basically it. It's like me walking around with my face mask right now, you know, it's common sense, right? Right. <laughs> well, subscribe and share. Thanks for the uh, thanks for the support, and um, you know, okay. Now I got a flower on my hair, right? <laughs> All right, sweet. <laughs> Uh, it's it's uh, Vietnam is awesome. That's all I can say. Vietnam is awesome. I love it here. Um, I'm still getting used to a, a few things. I'm only been here for about a year and um, a year and almost a half. You know, so I'm still getting used to stuff and still getting used to my surroundings. You know, it's gonna be a long process. It's gonna take me at least a good five years to really acclimate to a lot of stuff, but by then I should have a lot more knowledge, a lot more um, uh, uh, um, information about things, and I, I and, and that's it. Yo, what's up? What are you doing? It's my buddy back there. <laughs> you know. So people know me everywhere. For the short space of time I've been here, people know me. All around this neighborhood because I'm walking around all the time and I'm you know I'm just kind of you know say hello to people. Well, even if people don't say hello to me first, I say hello I say hello first and then you know I start I start the ball rolling. You know what I'm saying? That's how you do it. That's how you do it. Yeah. Hey. 
Jesus Christ, come on, okay? Come on.